Neighbors coming back to their home in this northwest side neighborhood were surprised to see police tape and flashing lights, especially in the middle of the afternoon. An officer involved shooting began here in the 6400 block of Kentstone Drive near 62nd Street and Michigan Road. Just too much violence. Officers came to the area for a shots fired call and found two people with gunshot wounds. One went to the hospital in critical condition, the other in stable. And I just went to go dump some leaves and then you come back and you hear someone got shot around three o'clock on a Saturday. I mean, what's going on? And this is a nice, quiet neighborhood and there's kids always down there playing. Police quickly noticed a vehicle that matched the one they were looking for and the driver led them on a chase. Shelby Kegler Jr. says he believes he saw that chase as he was driving near Michigan Road. Because he was just driving casually and there were two cops following him. And so I just kept driving. I saw more cops come, more cops come. And then I went to get lunch. And then when I came back, I saw uh, an ambulance, fire truck, cops come all over here. Neighbors say the levels of violence is disgraceful across the city. They feel sorry for all of the families impacted, including those affected by today's gunfire. I just feel bad for the uh, families and I saw uh, grandmother and some of the women and they were just hugging each other and it's just like man on Memorial Day weekend we still had this violence on the northwest side Courtney Crown CBS 4 News Mayor Joe Hogsett reacted to the violence in a couple of tweets earlier this evening he said quote I am relieved that the wounded IMPD officer is in good condition though my thoughts are with all those affected by this incident he went on to say today's event underscores the bravery of our IMPD officers in the face of danger as well as the destructive impact that gun violence has on anyone who encounters it.